Hey y'all, it's Nikki. Welcome or welcome back to the channel. Now, if y'all want to see how I got this look, then y'all just keep on watching. Hey you guys, the wig I'm from today is from Sensationelle's Dashley Collection. And here's the stock card, y'all. It says it's virtually undetectable HD lace. It's a deep center part with baby hairs. Essential to your wig stash. Heat resistant. Available in fashion forward colors. And you can dress it up or down, y'all. Now, I have the style curtain bangs, lace unit number 26, and the color money piece caramel. It comes with two combs in the back, a comb, I mean two combs in the front, a comb in the back, and adjustable straps. Now, on my unit, it, um, I'm sure it was a manufacturing issue, but on mine, you know, one of the straps were like, you know how you connect them in the hole, the loop? One of them, like on one side, like you can't put it in, like it's closed up. So, if you want to adjust the straps, you have to pull that one side all the way to the other side, which is no big deal. A lot of ladies with smaller heads have to do that anyways. But um, I think I have an average size head and I didn't connect it and it feels fine to me. But um, I'm pretty sure it's a manufacturing issue. These things happen, you know, quite a lot with the wigs. But um, it's no big deal. Like I said, it's fitting fine. And I'm sure it's not every wig. It's just, you know, sometimes that stuff happens. But um yeah, it's a, like I said, cap size is average. It feels fine. It's a good density. And this is the length on me. The texture is going to be like a light yakky texture, guys. Um, I went ahead and styled this mostly on the mannequin head, as y'all seen. And I think it turned out really nice. Now, I will say there is some shedding. I don't know if it's major, major, but, you know, it's going to be there. And um, the tangling, it was pretty much tangling kind of straight out of the pack. Like, soon as you tried it on and started, like, pl you know, playing with it, it's kind of tangled immediately. Like, before I even cut the lace, it was, like, especially in the back, it was, like, kind of dry and frizzy. And I showed y'all a clip. 
So um, I went ahead and used some of this wig, wig conditioner spray. And I think it helped a lot. And um, yeah, that was it. So just be mindful of the tangling and some shedding. So if you wear it out, you know, you might want to keep your comb or brush handy. I think um, I love this color, y'all. These highlights are really, really pretty. They're this money piece caramel. It's not too much, but it just gives it a pop. You know, it brings out the wig. You know, it takes it to another level. And um, it's really easy. It's glueless. I don't got no, no tape for glue. So very easy. And um, I have it kind of, you know, fluffed out a bit, you know. So it's giving it a more glamorous type look. But if you want it more like the model, you know, you could just twist it some. And, you know, it's more tamed and more wearable for every day but um i had to comb mine out because it was so tangly but um usually i wouldn't mess with it usually i just leave it as is but um it's it's fine because i like this look with this color and the style i think it looks really good i love the framing of the face with the curtain bang i think it's really cute and um i think this like originally looking at the stock card I would think it was like an everyday type of wig but after getting it and playing with it and styling it like personally for mine and the way I have it styled it would be just for like special occasions date night going out and stuff like that this wouldn't be everyday for me personally but um, it definitely can be I think and you know a natural color and speaking of color they have a lot of good specialty colors y'all and um, but I love this caramel color. It's really nice. But, um, yeah. So, it's pretty easy. Not much work, really. Just some heat. And, you know, keeping that brush handy. And other than that, I think you're good to go. So, you guys, let me know your thoughts. Do you like this color? Would you get it, like, in a natural color? Or would you get one of the special colors? And would you wear it more tamed? Or would you... Uh, do the more flared out type of look, y'all. Let me know which one you like best. And I did show you at the beginning as well, you could shift it if you want, but it's meant for a center part and I think it looks best that way, especially with the face framing curtain bangs. So I would leave it as a center part. But if you just have to have a side part, you could shift it. But I'd rather just get a style already to the side if that's what you're looking for. But um, yeah, this is gorgeous as a middle part. And yeah, guys, it's it's really cute. You could dress it up or down, like it says, and it's a good one to have, and it's and it's affordable too, guys. I'm pretty sure it's and uh, it's under four dollars, <laughs> so pretty good, guys. Now that's about it. If you have any questions or comments, hit me up. I appreciate you for watching, and you know I'll see y'all next time.